Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the bizarre magic of Brian Rushwood. At this point, I need the two biggest, hugest, tallest, strongest guys in the entire freaking room to join me up here on stage. I don't care who they are, you guys select them from yourselves. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Feel like that. We'll, we'll do it with three, four, four dudes. That's, I didn't come out right. All right. Check this out and make sure it's exactly what it looks like. I'm going to tell you a secret that drives magicians nuts. Every time you ever see a magician escape from one of these, they're cheating. They use tricky straight jackets that have a secret handle <laughs> deep inside the sleeve. Reach all the way down. <laughs> Reach all the way down to the bottom of the sleeve. Because in a tricky jacket, there'll be a secret handle that you can hold on to for extra slack. Other versions might have like a Velcro strap that can be pulled apart. Or maybe a stretchy part that's spandex. Make sure it's all canvas and leather. Look good to you guys. Just like the one Clipster has at home. Alright, here we go. Straight jacket goes on from the front like so. You'll see there's three buckles at the back. Three of you guys reach over and start strapping those up. They work just like the belt buckles around your waist. Keep in mind that how impressive this is in a moment will depend entirely on how cool you guys are. So at all times, show absolutely no mercy, which none of you bastards is having any trouble with. For those of you guys... Who oh, hold on there, Tiger. Let's break your turn. <laughs> Somebody's excited. All right. <laughs> For those of you guys who want, whoa! Somebody's experienced. <laughs> Let's go in order. Hang on there, buddy. Let's just hands off the crocs. There we go. All right. Uh, you can buy tricky straight jackets from Magic Shops. This is not one of them. This one came from uh, the Humane Restraint Company out of Madison, Wisconsin. They're the world's larger, largest supplier of humane restraints. Their catalog is freaking terrifying. Do me a favor. One of you guys grab the end of this side here. Make sure you grab the sleeve, not the strap. One of you on this side. Pull apart. Let's get some tension here. Is it not, not a contest? <laughs> because I know who will win. All right. On the count of three, you're going to cross over in front and meet at the back. You're going to go over top. You're going to go under my right arm. Little bear going through the cage. You got it? Yeah, 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 correct. But, but please get uh, somebody's grabbing me from my backside. Let's, how about you go away? <laughs> All right, ready? One, two, three. Pass over in front. There we go. Back, 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 back. Get to the microphone. <laughs> Take the long leather strap from my right arm. You're gonna thread it through that steel grommet on the left arm. Look, look, look. You guys are good. Oh, whoa, Tiger, hold on. You gotta thread it before you start yanking me. Otherwise, you just yank it for fun. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with that. <laughs> Once that's threaded through, you gotta thread it through, there we go. Once it's threaded through, I mean it, you guys all work together to pull that thing to the tightest notch you can possibly. <laughs> <laughs> Take the... Oh, we're at a high elevation. Uh, instructions before. <laughs> Alright, whoa, 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 whoa. Once you do have it threaded through, pull straight down to the ground as far as it'll go. <laughs> Let's have a huge round of applause for all four of these guys to hit back to their seats. <laughs> this is feels, feels like a thumb. <laughs> I mean, I would imagine that's what a thong would feel like. <laughs> All right, folks, this is a regulation of solid machine straight jackets. They are outlawed in 26 and 50 states for being cruel and inhumane. Pretty sure we just found out why. <laughs> At the turn of the century, Houdini set the standard for straight jacket escapes by escaping from a real straight jacket in two minutes and seven seconds. Tonight, I'm going to try to beat that record and escape in under a flat two minutes. If I fail, I will refuse any payment or compensation for this entire weekend's visit, which obviously impresses none of you. <laughs> Hold on. Just like, hang on the other side. Uh, that's, that's too much. Uh, however, if I do manage to escape it under a flat two minutes, beating the record of Houdini, 
All I ask is that each of you guys leap to your feet yelling and screaming, making more noise than I've ever heard in my entire life, so that for one awesome moment, I can bask in the loudest ovation I've ever received. Now here's the thing, I can't see the clock behind me while I escape, so you guys have to shout out the time remaining every 10 seconds. When that clock shows, one minute and 50 seconds, you will all say, one minute and 50 seconds. Right. We settle on 150, I think that'll work better. When it says 140, you'll all shout, 140. Perfect. You guys ready? Uh, yeah. I mean, are, are you ready? <laughs> Let's try that again. Are you guys ready? Yeah! Get set! Yo! Thank you so much. I'll see you guys outside. Have a great one.